Hello everyone. This video is intended to be a brief look at a writing sample from Pelican's newest M600, the Glocal Combone, which is part of their new art collection. I purchased a medium nib uh, with mine, and the uh, purpose for a medium nib was just to get a little bit of um, kind of middle of the road width. This is Pelican's typical 14-carat, uh, um, two-tone rhodium-plated nib. There's nothing fancy here, nothing unique to the addition, so any um, M600 nib would swap in without issue. The pen does post securely for those that like to post their pen. My nib uh, came well aligned out of the box. Um, there was no hard starts, um, no skips and um, ultimately the feed is very wet. Um, so it writes very well in terms of um, prolonged uh, stasis. You, un you leave it capped and you leave it in your drawer for a little bit, you bring it out, it's, it's gonna write. Um, if you're taking notes and you don't, you know, uh, cap your pen frequently, it's not going to dry out on you in, in an instant. Um, so I appreciate that. And that's generally true of Pelicans. There has been, you know, historically um, an issue with um, Pelicans nibs running fairly wide um, for what they are. But um, I've seen that get better over the last uh, couple years. And in my experience these days, the nibs are running pretty true to their designation. Um, Unfortunately, there is no line variation, so you don't get any, you know, different cross strokes or down strokes like you did with the old vintage nibs. However, the nib is dependable. Um, what I'm using here um, for an ink was um, uh, Pelican's own uh, 4001, the um, Dunkel Groom or uh, Dark Green. I haven't used that one in a while, and I thought it was a, a nice one to pull out. It definitely uh, flows nicely in this pen. So that basically is a brief look at a writing sample from Pelican's M600 Glocal Combone.